Hello everyone, welcome to Knob Talk. See you guys in a second. Remember to like, subscribe, and hit the notification button. Welcome back to Knob Talk. I'm sorry about delay for two weeks. I haven't got a video done because I had technical problems and other things came up. So I wanted to make sure we keep on a steady pace. So what we're talking about, opening your own business. Okay, so we've talked about all the licensing process. Um, I talked about a couple of process of why, why you, you know, find your why. So that way you can decide what business you want to open up and where you want to go. So this one, I want to give you guys a little bit of in-depth on how to market your product. First, find a marketing company. The marketing company should have some profiles where they have had success stories and which businesses. I want you to check those out. Um, also check the references. Um, so all the businesses, call them up and see how their service was. To pick a marketing service, you have to go through um, a few. So there's a couple of them out there that are like Yelp um, that I would not recommend but there's a couple of that will recommend. It's all up to you to find out and decide which one you wanna go through. You can Google up, you can see all that. There's gonna be a lot of people that are on there that don't do much, but they advertise themselves. So if you see an ad on the Google when you search, don't select on the ad, select on the organic links. The organic links have a way of doing SEO organically. Um, SEO is search engine optimization. So let me give you guys a little example of how uh, to market your product. So once you know your why, okay, once you know your why, and you have a great marketing team behind you, you want to find out what cities, what market your product or your service will be the most profitable. So profitable doesn't have to be in your own town. It can be like different state, different town, just across the street town, or, you know, it depends on what your service is and what your why is to how to market it to the right people and to get the max ROI, so return on investment. So you wanna get the max ROI and what um, your why is pushing. So understand, and your marketing team will work with you on this. So what deals to open, um, what things you can do to motivate people to click on you, what motivates people to go and buy from your store, or what motivates people from eating at your restaurant. So depending on what you're doing, you have to have certain different types of discounts to encourage people to make an action. So make sure you have a strong marketing team. And then find out what costs um, are gonna be incorporated with it. How much would it be monthly? Um, how much extra you have to do? What products you need to put out and boost more? Um, and what plans and what strategy you have to go through? So you have to have a strategy on how you're gonna go through this. If you're a restaurant owner, you have to have your deals for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. What you're trying to do is you're trying to attract all different types of, you know, depending on your menu, all different types of demographic to your restaurant if you're trying to open a restaurant. If you're trying to open a retail store, you're trying to have a couple of discounts, let's say 10 to 15% discounts, uh, buy one, get one free discounts. Uh, make sure that you're not going broke by adding these um, coupons because the coupons should be boosting yourself. So make sure you're adding up and distracting um, how much you're spending and then also make sure you're adding margin to it. Margin is the extra price that you want to sell it. So usually it's like three times what you buy. So you gotta make sure that you're doing the right tricks um, and trades. So most of the times, 
when you see buy one get one free the one item has already paid for the second item and more to get people in so but it's just a met mind of the person it's just a mind you're attracting so the people that you're attracting to your product and make sure you have good quality product that you're giving out or good quality service if you're doing um, online service or are you doing like local service window service it depends on what you want to do make sure you're giving the best you can and always make sure that the customer is satisfied and make sure they're coming back so that is another strategy that works out punch cards if you're a coffee shop owner they have punch cards they have 10 you know if you get the ninth one the tenth one's on us if you get nine coffees you know so that is getting them back nine times and then they give them another card and in restaurants what they do is if you come back you get rewards so every time you get back you get a percentage you get a point um, depending on what you're doing too and if you are retail you give them coupons so there is a way of getting people back so you got to have a strategy to get customers a strategy to keep customers coming back and then those strategies to intertwine to make sure that you're getting the best ROI for your business. Get a great marketing team that will accelerate your profit and accelerate your business. Thanks for watching Not Talk. See you guys tomorrow. And make sure you like subscribe and comment and share this video with somebody that needs it. Thank you.